Z <laughs> what the fuck? Much better. Zuck the cook. Dude is a slimy lizard and I've known it since day one. Why? Because Facebook is just full of oldies and goldies. No, Facebook's fine if you want to find your friends from 50 years ago and see what they're doing, but Facebook has always been a red flag for me. I remember people telling me, when it's downloaded on your phone, you they could stalk you, this, that, and the other. I knew that shit, I deleted it. I sometimes go on it on a computer at work. Don't tell my boss. But all jokes aside, right, Mark Kuckerberg has just admitted, wow, this is unsurprising and not at all surprising. He's basically admitting a couple things. I'll get the letter up in a moment and you can have a look. Um, I'm not going to read it all because I can't read and it's way too long for me to read. But basically, he has admitted that the um, the Democratic Party, you know, the evil corporation, nah, I'm joking, all governments are evil, but the Democrats are just stinky fuckers, aren't they? Honestly, they stink the place out like a, a skunk that's been injected with steroids. I mean, that shit is just stinking out the White House. I'm not saying Donald Trump's a good guy. I don't really care. But holy shit, Joe Biden is basically causing two wars and we're heading towards something even better. But he is basically admitting that they were forcing him to censor speech over COVID, etc. So let's break it down very slightly and very quickly because who the fuck cares? Everyone should care. This is serious, dis blah, 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 serious business. The US government interacts with companies like Meta. The platform is for everyone. We are promoting speech and helping people connect in a safe, secure way. Bullshit. They have basically said senior officials in the Biden administration, including the White House, repeatedly pressured them for terms for months centering certain COVID-19 content. So remember that COVID jab we all got and all fucking people have died and shit and we're all fucking loopy. Yeah. Blame these suckers. I have a story about COVID-19 vaccine that I might share one day, but holy, it's, you know, it's done shit to me. It's done shit to people I know. My grandma had it a month before she died and she died of a heart attack. Now, my grandma was old. You know what I mean? But she was not on her way out. You know, she probably had a couple years left. Am I going to ever tell my dad that? No, because I'm not a bad guy. Ultimately, it was our decision whether or not to take the con and we own our decision included that. Uh, so they agreed. We believe the government pressure was wrong and I regret that we were not out more outspoken. So he regrets that his position in it. He is a Trump fan. I've seen the fan of him, uh, the video of him going when Donald Trump got shot and he does that and he said, that's badass, man, that's sick. You know what I mean? He realises that these guys are evil. Like I said to our team at the time, I feel strongly that we should not compromise our content standards due to the pressure from any administration in any direction, which is true. The FBI warned us about a potential Russian disinformation operation about the Biden family in Burisma that led to the 2020 election. That fall when we saw the New York Post say corruption allegation involved in the Democrat president, Joe Biden, we sent that story to Fact Checkers Review and temporarily demoted it while waiting for a reply. So they basically turned it down so less people People saw it because Joe Biden's evil, you know what I mean? That whole Democrat, you know, people forget like the Clintons, they are pedophile, like the nonces. Have you not seen the documentary? He had a picture of Bill Clinton on his wall in a dress. How many times did Bill Clinton go to the fucking island, bro? That's what I want to know. Bill Gates as well, what's he fucking doing? People keep telling me he's releasing mosquitoes into the air. I'm like, why the fuck's he doing that? I thought mosquitoes were like bad, you know what I mean? I remember if he went to Africa as a child, you have to get a mozzie fucking shit up your ass cheeks. It's since been made clear that the reporting was not Russian disinformation, so they lied and said, oh, Russia are making these stories, blah, 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 and they found out, now that's actually false. We are actually liars. We are liars. Politicians lie. We shouldn't have demoted the story. We've changed our policy and process to make sure this doesn't happen again. For instance, we no longer temporarily demote things in the US while waiting for fact checkers. So that's right. You know, uh, unfortunately, free speech is the most important thing, and unfortunately in life, there are always going to be idiots. Everything you do. There's white idiots. There's black idiots. There's Every type of idiot, if you speak to a hundred people, doesn't matter what ethnicity, doesn't matter whatever, there are always going to be donkeys in that group. It's a fact. Humans are just stupid and idiotic and now we had that COVID-19 vaccine, bro, we're really fucking stupid. No, I'm joking. Apart from content moderation, I want to address the contributions I made during the last presidential. So he gave them a load of cash. The idea here was to make sure local election jurisdiction across the country had the resources they need to help provide, promote, <gasps> need to help people vote safely during a global... I made these contributions through the Chan Zucker which I'm pretty sure will be his wife. I know his wife's Asian and that. Me being a racist. That's a joke. That looks like an Asian name to me. They were designed to be non-partisan, whatever that means, spread across urban, rural and suburban communities. Despite this, I've shown I've been shown otherwise. So he gave us money, promised, yeah, we'll invest into community, make the world better. We promise, just come on, give us the money. Give us the money. Give me the money. Still, despite the analysis I've seen otherwise, I know that some people believe this is the work benefit one party over the other. My goal is to be neutral, not playing a role in any other way, which is right, or to even appear to be playing, so I don't plan on making a similar contribution. Respectfully, Zuck. 
the cook. This is huge, lads. Absolutely ginormous. He has basically admitted that the government paid, or didn't pay him, but the government forced him to basically push the cush George Bush. You know what I mean? So, you know, that is against the Constitution. You know, I'm not American, but it's all about free speech. Guns, bro. Bah, 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 bah. You know what I mean? You cannot censor someone, and you cannot tell them to shut up. Unfortunately... That's what they did. So in my book, that is against the rules, is it not? And what happens when you break the rules? You go to jail. So why are these motherfuckers not in jail? Because they are rich and they are above the law. These guys have more money than sense. They have so much political belief, so much political influence on people. And I don't know anything about Kamala Harris. How the fuck is she in this position? This is like going for a job interview, right? Just a job interview, right? You're coming in as a warehouse staff. In about six months time, you're gonna be running the place. It's a global business. You're going to be at the top, sat at the seat, drinking your fine wine, drinking your espresso martini, whatever you drink when you're rich. I don't know. I have no money. I can barely afford the water coming out of my tap, man. And he's basically got away with, you know, she's, she's been put in this position somehow. I think they honestly went, she's a woman. People will vote for a woman. Bro, I would not care what you look like. Gender. I don't care if you were a transgender. I don't care if you were a, a rainbow alien from outer space with three testicles if you are the best person for the job you're the best person for the job and unfortunately she's not the best person for the job and the only other person for the job is donald trump uh, so what do you do well i would have voted for rk i know that's like the right decision but i know they know some stinkers they've said they're going to come out and tell us all about the jfk i want to know about that shit but i've watched so many documentaries on jfk who fucking did it the fbi it's so clear now if you don't believe it was the fbi why would they say they're going to release all these files it'd be pointless if rfk has seen these or if they know what's in these files why would they bullshit and say well we could release it but there's nothing in them you know imagine if it was just fucking this bloke you know what i mean but anyway we all know it wasn't this bloke even russell brand's about it so so he's basically admitted to censorship, which is important. You know, I, I, I actually respect him a, a great deal more than I did before. And I think he's been unfortunately caught um, in this loop. He was like the first big social media. And they said, hell, you're going to tell us all this information about people or you're off. As a, as, a, as a Mark Zuckerberg would have been, he would have not known what to do, would he? You know, and I don't blame him for doing it. And I, I, I apologize for calling him a cook. I, I actually think what he's doing here is admirable. Admirable. What he's doing is admirable. Is that the right word? I think I, I, I'm actually quite... Well, I think I was going to say proud. Why would I... You know, you're proud of your dog when he does his first shit. Like, no, I'm, I'm happy that he's done this properly. It just shows how corrupt these guys are. If, we, you know, what we need is just to leave. Elon Musk needs to make these fucking space rockets. Make a cool spaceship that just flies a billion miles around. I'm just leaving. I'm off, dude. I'm fucking gone. Like Donkey Kong. That shit is over. I don't want to be part of this planet anymore. I don't want to be part of a government. I am not voting. You know, in Australia, if you don't vote, you get fined. What's that about? What about if it was Adolf Hitler versus Stalin? Would you fucking vote then? It's like, just because it's shit versus shit doesn't mean you should force yourself to vote. It makes no goddamn sense motherfucker joe biden you're a rat bastard kamala harris i don't have an opinion on you other than i'm i'm confused how you've got this job i'm confused you know what i mean i am and respect to mark zuckerberg you know well you know he's got he's got balls on him because now he's in the firing line elon musk has big balls as well not that i'm certain of but metaphorically he's got ginormous testicles he's in the firing line as well you know if any of these guys get killed or someone just shot them Bullshit, motherfucker. Bullshit. Bullshit, man. These guys are going to try get him out. I don't believe this random kid tried killing Donald Trump. I do not for a fact. No way, ho hey. You know, I don't believe it. No chance. Doesn't make sense. The roof was slanted. The roof was slanted. You are FBI. Can you not fucking stand on a slanted roof? Are you kidding me? Are you joking? You can't stand on a slanted roof. I could. And yeah, I'm a human peak specimen at his highest form i get that but some of these motherfuckers i played enough dying like two to know how to parkour and drop kick zombies all right fbi should have at least fucking know what to how to stand on a slanted roof anyway guys i'm waffling i just be careful out there in it and mark zuckerberg I, I respect you for this i hope um you know they're gonna try get him or elon they're gonna try shoot these guys because they are not bending and i strongly believe in that Ah, <sighs> yes, yeah, a scary time, lads. Look, look after yourselves. Um, if you have a lot of money, I'd recommend building a nuclear bunker. That's what I'd do. Instead, uh, if you don't have money, just enjoy your remaining hours here.
because uh, they're going to run out. Nah, that's a cynical thing to say, and I don't think that's true. But, you know, censorship here, you know, this is just him admitting to one censorship. What about all the res the other censorship shit? Goddamn, motherfuckers, goddamn.